We are doing some bow fishing now, and we are gonna hopefully wrangle up something to eat. Uh, we don't know what to expect. This is the first time we got the, uh, the the boat out here. This is the big kitty cat boat. Meow. We're ready to take her on the river. We got an entire trash can loaded with uh, bow setups right there. Uh, we've got trolling motor filled with juice. We've got a 150 that's filled with fuel, and we're ready to go. We're gonna dump her on the river. The river is moving. You can see the freaking water. How's that going? Fill, fill up that river. We've had no, we, we, the river's been low for a while. We're in a drought. Uh, but we are not, we're not doing any fishing. We're doing bow fishing. Uh, we're going to scout for catfishing areas. We're going to be doing this in a completely different area of the river. We've, uh, I think we've been here one, one time a couple years ago. But we're going to explore, find some new places to set some cat lines for future videos once the water warms up a little bit. But more importantly, we're going to go after some fish to shoot. This could be gar, it could be big heads, could be commons, could be grass carps, and could even be the flying Asian carp that come in and slap you right in the face. So somebody yeah, may get slapped, huh? Put this together this morning. What do you think about that? Really? You think the old recurve's going to do it? I don't I know. More importantly, do we have any snacks, Bancho? You're on snack duty. Yeah. Oh yeah, we do. I got them. I got them. I already put them in the boat. Oh, like, you did? I don't have any on mine. Where did you put them? Where, when did he sneak them in the boat? I've been watching him. He didn't get I said, them. you're on snack duty. Don't forget it, okay? There's only two things that are crucial to a bow fishing deal, okay? One, some ice cold mountain shoe. And two, Boom. warm pocket jerky. We've got some beefcake jerky. It is dropping on June 1st, by the way. Um, and these are not here. You want to toss me some? These are not the finished packaging. As you can tell, it is experimental product only. Uh, these are our samples. They taste phenomenal. And very soon, we've got the commercial run uh, that we're going to be bringing in and turning basically my house into a fulfillment center. Uh, and then we're going to ship them out to you guys. So we do have some boat snacks and some stuff to say hydrated. And it's going to be a good day. It's a beautiful, oh, sunscreen. That's I need that too. We need, we need some sunscreen. I need to get, you want to hit me with some? Oh, we're not the only ones. Uh -oh. Rick, who in the hell do you think you are, Ricky? Coming out here on my stomping ground. I'm just kidding, I've never been here, but there it is. There, important. This is, you got to have this. You got to, you have to have this stuff. Especially, this is the first, this is the first adventure of the year, okay? This skin has not seen the harsh sun on a boat in, uh, well, about nine months turn into a freaking Larry the Lobster out here. So we're gonna get uh, gonna get lathered up here. Banjo's gonna start getting naked at some point. And we're just gonna dump the boat and explore. We're just gonna have a good time. I mean, you can't ask for better weather. It's like 65, 70 degrees, sunny, bluebird skies. We got, got more just in case we run out. Oh, okay, thank God, I was concerned. All right, anyways, enough jabbering. Launch the boat in the water. And go see if we can find us up some fish to shoot. Bring them home to eat, stay tuned. Boy, does that get me horny. Holy smokes, it's been a minute since I heard that. Yee! We're off, boys. Oh, dude, they're right here. Bro, I just really? saw them. I just saw them. They're right here. Hang on. Hold up. Hold up. Dude, there's fish right here, dude. They're coming out of the spillway. We ain't gotta go four feet. I, I swear I saw a dorsal. We literally joked. We're like, they're probably gonna be right by the spillway. I swear I saw a dorsal fin, though. It looked more like a carp than a gar. But, listen. If it sticks, we eat it. That's the plan. Oh yeah, that makes me horny. Oh yeah, baby. There it is. There it is. Really? All right. Well. We saw a couple. One Asian carp went flying up, but didn't didn't make it in the boat and didn't give me enough time. So we're gonna look on the map here and see if we can find some cuts. The cuts is usually where a lot of fish are, especially those flying Asian carp, which those are always fun because half the time they just jump in the boat. You ain't gotta shoot them. Sometimes you can shoot them in the air. So fire up the motor, see if we can go find them. Stay tuned. <laughs> that easy believe it or not this one's got a little bit of water i don't know if we can get back there or not but big sheila this boat right here she ain't no big really we're still only eight foot so there's a bunch of dead fish on the bank should we just do a roadkill video or no sure no i'm good you don't want to do that no we've always wanted to do roadkill catch not on that. fish that's gross yeah that's as if a, as if as if a deceased raccoon on the road's not gross well not a coon like a deer yeah. oh that'd be fine shoot this bird he was thinking. He was thinking about it. 
What was that? I think we hit sand here. We're stuck. Oh yeah, that's the, that's the beach, buddy. We got a problem. There it is. Oh god, yeah. <laughs> right, right in the bottoms there. All right, boys. Well, so far, caught myself. I broke the troll motor. Banjo's damp, not in a good way. And we have yet to see a fish. Stay tuned. There's bald eagle. Look at that. You must smell the jerky. Freedom. Well, we found one with water. Not exactly uh, as big as the canal that we had thought the other one was, but this one's decent. There's at least water back here. Is there going to be fish? I don't know. You don't know until you try. So this is work. We've been on this area of the river one time before two years ago, but we've never been boat fishing up here. And since then, a lot's changed with the water level. So I mean, there's some good water back there. Yeah. You like that? Yeah, that's good. That's a good oh, rig. one Asian just jumped right there. Really? So what, we should go real quiet for gar and commons and big heads, mm -hmm. and then if not, start whipping these. Okay. There's one swimming right there. Is that a beaver? Shoot him. Oh yeah, we're already about to shoot this beaver. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. You can't do that, all right? Banjo can. Banjo, you got it? No. Invasive. You got the, yeah. Those are your Asians. Yeah. There's a gar. Gar right off the tip. Right off the tip. Ready, Banjo? Three, two, one. Oh, you, you both went left of it. suck ass. Got it. All right. Well, what in the Sam hell, Rick? One. Really? We've seen one measly little freaking gar. That's it in this whole stretch. Oh, oh. The Asians. You might need to fire up the big motor. All right, boys. Asian carps are horny. They love them some prop wash. Here, kitty, 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 kitty. I think I got him. Did I? Oh, no, that was a gar. Yeah, that was a gar. Yeah, that was a gar. He was a little deep. Oh, oh sh**. All right. Yeah, go, yeah. Slow, go slow, go slow. Maybe, yeah, kill it, kill it, kill it. They're right here. See that one, Andrew? Yep, you go ahead. Oh, right oh, over him. over it, just over it. Really? Here you go on this side. Yeah, it was idle up here. Two of them. Oh, I'm way high, way high. Oh, my gosh. Dude, they're all in here, they're all in here. Easy. We found the mother load, boys. Got him. Got him. Got him. Got him. Got him, boys. <laughs> Shoot him, Banjo. Oh! Let's go, boys. Straight harvest. Oh, they're jumping. Oh, dude, there's a million. Here, drop the drop the trolley and get us stopped real fast. Dude, we're on them, boys. You got him. He's huge. He's huge. Yeah, I got him, I got him. Right through the head. Let's go. Bring him in. Holy fuck. Let's go. No, 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 no. Oh. Rip. All right, boys. One in the can. I think we found him, huh? Dude, they're everywhere. Yeah. Yeah, keep an eye out for yours, Banjo. He might yeah, be. He rip. might have made it. Those suckers are freaking tough, though. Yo, Mondo oh right God. here. Mondo. Mondo, shoot that Banjo, one, Banjo. Shoot him. Yep. yep. No, yep. you got him. You got him. No yeah, way. Banjo's a sniper. No way. Right, I'll delay this one. Okay. Whoa! <laughs> Which way is he going? He's under. Right. Grab the line. Here. here. Gotta be close. No. Really? What? Really? I got him right here. Right here. Got him! Got him! Got him! Got him. Oh, let's go! That's a bigger one. Woo! Right in the can. <laughs> let's go, boys! <laughs> Easy. Hang on, hang on. <laughs> you got like three seconds. I'm trying. Here, I got him right here. He went on two out here. You go top, I go bottom. Yeah, one to the left. Oh, just go left, go left. She's the one left. One, two, three. You got him? No. We both missed, I think. Yeah. Boys, found a does it feel good to shoot some freaking fish? Major, you're freaking ace. Yeah, but I can't get him landed. Well, he's hitting them though. Yeah. I mean, I'd say our accuracy ain't bad. We've yeah, only no, shot five times bad. each, probably. All right, we're going to make another pass, but on our way out, I'm going to keep an eye out for big Sheila. We've shot some big dogs out here before. These guys aren't that big. We haven't seen any Mondo Mondos, but they're decent size, and they're definitely edible. Oh, yeah. They ain't, they ain't too bad. Right in front, little guy. Right by the tongue. Oh, yeah, I see him. He's, a, he's tough to see right there. Yeah. We're going to go out to the tip, flip around. The wind's picked up, which doesn't help a whole lot. 
But boy, did we find a hell of a gar hole. Oh, big Sheila, what are you doing, dog? There's one, there's one up here. Big fat girl. That's nice and wide. Oh, right there, right there. There she is. Oh, she's still right there. Golly, I snipped her nose. She's right there. That was her, dude. I told you she was a big dog. Mm -hmm. She was a big girl sunning herself. She's letting it all hang out up here on the beach. How's that going? Dude, it's so I don't know why up. they make them like that, to be honest. Those things suck. <laughs> you can't reel them. No. You got three shots off while it's still reeling one in. Yeah, true. Yeah. Dang. That was the big girl I saw up there. You got an eye for them thick ones, you know? Oh. Uh. You're calling in? Yeah. This is a gar call. Uh. Should we chum them with beefcake jerky? They'd probably like it. I bet they'd get horny about that teriyaki. Anybody does. I know I get aroused, you yeah, know? So does Banjo. Look at that fat turtle. Holy smokes, look at him. Wow. Looks like a freaking hubcap off a car. <laughs> that thing's home. bigger than hell. He's got a little guy with yeah, him. Should, Should we steal him? There's not. Oh, hang on, we got one right here. He's just floating there, waiting for us, though. Got him. Yeah. Oh! Yeah. And he threw a flip! Look at that! Shit! Come on, buddy! Oh there it is! Oh, he's barely on there. Ba really? Good night, good night. Good night. Hey. You settle down, Rick. That's how I like it. You ain't got to redo the tip or nothing. Well, we got three in the bank here. Banjo, how's that going? He's a big catch or release guy, though. Uh -huh. He's giving him a call. Oh, I told you. You uh -huh. call and they came in. Uh -huh. There's a couple. Oh, yeah, we out there. Take an air out. You want to shoot this little one or no? Shoot that pencil. Get some practice. Shoot him low. Low. Oh, right, right off of this. I think you just gave him a little slap. Big one. Big one. Yep, I got yep, it. I got, yep, it. I got yep, it. He's yep. big. He's big. You know he's big, boys. You know he's big when he don't even surface, son. This is a big girl. We're gonna take her easy. Cause this is a big. Another arrow. Oh, nope, you're good. We, you're I got it. Oh, good lord. Ready? Ready for the swing? Really? Oh, really? Rick, like this. That's a bad dude. That's a. Do I talk about the of wide them? load? Yeah, that's, that's one of them. Holy smokes! Right through the freaking head too. That's one of them bigger. Wow. Wow, look at the thickness on that. That thing's got some girth. Just broke off. There it is. I'm tied the old Palomar back on. Ah, ah, ah. This is a two hand deal. Hey. Ah. Oh, God damn. I gotta wash my hands now. Damn, son. Really? You bullfrog hunting? Was that your bullfrog call? What was that? Oh, man. Long day at work there. Shooting them fish banjo, you know. I mean, I haven't landed one, but I've been shooting them. Shooting them at them, Banzo's been shooting them. But there's nothing more better. Fresh out of the cooler, a little cool, a little crisp action. Mmm. Dude, every time, every time, the blood just starts flowing, you know? You ready to go again? This <laughs> rummer's ready to... Van Dam? Yep. I got a Van Dam out there. Well, take a little break, drink some Mountain Shoe, eat some jerky. Jake's gonna grab the recurve. See if we can make something happen. Stay tuned. All right, boys. Drink about a half a mountain shoe, a few pieces of jerky. I am ready to get back in the sack. Wait, hang on. What's turtle. that? Is that a turtle? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Sure, what's, what do you got going on here? The old recurve. I put this on there today. And this little rest. You shot it yet or no? No. Okay. No idea if it works. All right. Yeah. Now, this is our third pass in here, so keep that in mind. Yeah. We're starting to get fewer and fewer. Um, but we'll see what happens here, and then we may venture up the river, see if we find a couple more spots, and just look for a couple big Sheila's. But all I know is that, right there, ladies and gentlemen, that's dinner, and I'm excited. How'd that go? I don't know. You see, look at this beaver right here. See him? Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah? There he goes. See if you, see if you want some jerky. Give him some, Dude, he's huge. He's big, it's a furry beaver. How'd that shoot? Good or no? This we finally dog, found one. Sucks. I just don't know where the hell the he fish was, went. He, that was the first fish we see in two passes. We're gonna have to rip it another cup, maybe, but we gotta go check it. The fruit beaver looked like he was doing something. Uh, anyways, well, don't see any more. So we hop on the big motor. Let's go find the next spot. Let's go do it.
just like that we are at Walmart. We found no more fish. For some reason, the only hole that we found was the gar hole. And that gar hole was one hell of a gar hole. So we are at Classic Walmart and we are gonna go inside and get some supplies to make gar sandwiches. That's right, we're gonna make some nice fat sand, huh? How many, How many parking, parking spots do you need, sir? I, bar I barely went over on that line, all right? How hot you think those gar are? Those gar are steamers. Yeah. What, uh, someone steals a few, maybe like four bows back there, and they steal them? They're not worth I'll stay with them. No, 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 it'd be all right. <laughs> we'll make, so listen, then we make another video chasing somebody down. Bam's gonna tackle them like Dog the Bounty Hunter, and then we can just see what happens there. But we're gonna go, and we're gonna try to make some fried gar. We're gonna try to make a sandwich. I don't think we've made a gar sandwich before. we made gar balls. We've actually just fried nuggets, but we're feeling a sandwich, like a good sandwich, like a hoagie bun that's toasted with slaw and sauce, something fire for dinner. So we're headed to Walmart. You guys stay tuned. All right, change the plans. We're making gar dogs. That's right, gar in a hot dog bun, gar dogs. We thought of that the last four seconds we walked in. Yes. What about those? those? Yes. They're Soft, white, popsicle. sesame so seed. It's like a hoagie. Oh, wait, that's not a, oh, hang on. That's not an actual bun. Let's see. Here's some top slice, though. You know how we are in top slice. Much in there. Okay, what about these? What about these? Dude, Sarah Lee gets it with these art artisana ones. You think that'll work? It's a little bigger. Yeah. What's it, is it Hawaiian? Oh, those are just rolls. No. Does Hawaiian make a hot dog bun or no? I think that's all we got. The rest of them are just normal. You good with that? Yep. Artisano? Mm -hmm. Yep. All right, so we've got gar dogs on the menu now. So now we gotta figure out what's gonna go top. I still think we should top it with slaw and some tartar sauce of some sort. Uh, and then we gotta get the breading, which I feel like the breading, in my opinion, flour and some all meat ducks and some buffalo. Mix that sucker together and you're gonna be, it. you're gonna be happy with it. It's gonna be a good product. So let's see, so what about some sauce and slaw? Slaw sauce. The, uh, they have, they have pre-made like slaw? Pre-made slaw like up here. And then sauce. sauce. All right, let's see some sauce, sauce. If I was tartar sauce, where would I be? Oh, wow, good lord, I'm glad you're tall. I would never seen that. Is that the only tartar they have? Sure. The one I saw. Are you on some cream style? Cream style, that's horseradish. Yeah, not but cream style. Really, you like that? Is that yeah. the only? I wish they had like our buffalo. I'm trying ranch to think, here. oh, I know. Remember they, we put that on that catfish? Thing? True. Extra hot. Really? Should we just grab some tartar sauce? Yeah, I want some right. like fancy. I know, I was looking for like some. Who's? Oh yeah. You gotta do it louder. I can't hear you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I don't know what they're yelling about. They're yelling. What do you got? Really? Should we? Who's what are you saying? Should we go see? Dude, pickled ranch might be good. Have you ever had that? No, let's get that, though. Okay, let's try I'll, I'll I, No, I'm down. All right, so we need to get some slaw. Like I said, I think we have pretty much everything for. I'm sure we have flour, and I'm sure we have some buffalo and some all meat. Oh, yeah. We've got the oil hot and ready to rock and roll. Let's go find some dirty slaw. Is that the dirty slaw you're after? Sure. Coleslaw, freshness guaranteed, home style. Yup. That look appetizing to anyone else or no? No, it looks like mush. It, it does kind of look mushy. Oh, good. Yeah, it'll work. You can take yeah, it. Yeah, it's got yeah. that like purple cabbage. Yeah, the ca yeah, like, yeah I'm like, yeah. Hey, work. you're good it'll with it? Right. It'll work. All right, so we've got some interesting pickle ranch. We're gonna give that a try. We've got our buns. We've got the coleslaw. We're made ready to make gar dogs. We're gonna go home, get them cleaned up. Stay tuned. Bon appetit, just like that. Yeah? Well, we're gonna get her cleaned up. You can only see her on a cut, cause this, especially Gar, it's about to get a little western now. In the, see, Millie's still alive. Millie, everyone's concerned. Lucy's alive. She's hanging out. And uh, so we're gonna go ahead and get this guy cleaned up. Like I said, uncut, you can see it if you wanna check it out. What trying do you think? To, trying to lose part of your finger again, or yeah, what? Yeah, that's, that's the exact knife that took that piece of my finger out. I got no, got no feeling right there anymore. Big really? grip, fingerprint, definitely not gonna come up in the system anymore, so we're good. Uh, all right, well, let's get this guy cleaned up. Shoo! Look at that meat, folks. That is the big gar I shot. Cleaned up and ready to rock and roll. So we're gonna make gar dogs. We're gonna take, this as one filet. That's another filet. This was the second one, the first one. Did a little better on the second one. If you guys wanna see how we did it, it's on uncut. But we're in the man cave now. I'm gonna go ahead and slice this guy in half. I thought that was supposed to be boneless. What is that? You promised they me. They said it was gonna no be boneless. They said it was gonna be boneless. This back fillet is what? So where are the bones at? Right there. Are those bones or just tendons? I don't feel anything of uh, sharp. Cook no. it. Cook it. They, I really think they might be tendons. Seriously. Yeah. Wow. I probably like, that's crazy. Because I'm like, dude, there's no bone. Mm. There's no. End, there's no ends. It's smooth. The whole thing. Yeah. I think those are bones. Crazy. You think it's a bone? Why, why bones? They have those. I don't know. They I don't think that's a bone. I think it's just a tendon. Yeah. Cook it. Oh, so, we got there right there. We're gonna get another one. Slight, yes, that was a little better. Bam, bop, beep, do. So, we got these four 
They're going into the Frank's Buffalo hot sauce per usual. Now we've got this guy, which we've actually had before. Sometimes it's got a, really, Not bad. bless you. Really, most of the time it's kind of a pain because this thing's big, but since we have, but since there's a lot of uh, meat here, this is a pretty effective way to cover it thoroughly. And the, uh, the uh, fryer's getting hot. Banjo's grabbing the, the good stuff, the buffalo. So we're gonna go ahead and dump the just straight up flour. We're gonna go ahead and dump her in. That should hopefully do it. Dirty her up. And this, yeah, this, so this is one of these deals. Off, yeah. You just gotta give her one of these. You can't go, can't do too much. On folks. gar? I'd on gar? One of them. <laughs> We got some all, ducks lot. all meat. That looks pretty good. Yeah, I'd double and I'm gonna go. <laughs> you think so? Oh, we, God, can, yeah. we can throw some on top. We'll see what it looks like. There it is. Oh yeah, we need more. Any more? It needs oh, to yeah. look orange. Like. Yeah. <laughs> you wanna talk about spicy? Give that a sniff. God bless. That's the good stuff there. All right, we got about almost half a bottle of the good stuff in there. I mean, I don't know how that wouldn't. I'm gonna go ahead and just give her another one of these two. I don't think you can go wrong here, boys. There's some all meat in there. About a quarter jar of all meat. Half jar of buffalo. I'm gonna go ahead and throw these bad boys in. Fish out our guard dogs. And you're gonna lay them on there just like so. So we got the oil piping hot. We've got the coleslaw looking slawed. What are you looking for? That, Am I sack beeping? I, I, don't know I think I might beeping. be. I might be sack tapping the oven again. I'm not sure. All right, now take this. Make sure that's on really, really tight. And you flip it like this, and you basically you bread it down in the bottom. Most people are like, no, you just. You just do one of these, but when you flip it the other way, what it does is it separates the meat from the extra excess batter. And that's really the, the key to success here. Now you should just have perfectly breaded meat. Look at that. Oh, Sheesh. Heck yeah. Perfectly breaded. 360 bread. All right, boys. Let's head to the fryer. Going in right there. I mean, dude, just perfectly breaded. Yeah. This thing's pretty sweet. The old breaded bowl. It's a pain to clean. But when you got this much meat going in the fryer, it's worth it. Oh yeah, and you want your gar dogs to be perfectly evenly breaded. All right, boys, here we go. Sheesh. All right, we're gonna cook them till they're golden crispy and floating. Take them out, throw them between two cheeks, two buns, slap some tartar sauce, or you wanna try your dill I'm, ranch? I'm doing the ranch. So you, you wanna try it real quick? Sure. Take a quick bump. You take a raw bump or no? I'll take a raw bump, but I think really. Right. Some dill ranch. Yeah. You think it's gonna be good? I bet. I feel like Chick fil A's always got that little pickle taste, mm -hmm. so they could taste similar to that. Give her a whiff. Does it smell pickly or not really? Shoot a squirt right here, man. A little bit, not a whole lot. You gonna take a straight hit? I'll take a hit. Oh, damn, damn. <laughs> Way too much. Full no. shot. God, is it dilly or just a Pretty hit? Pretty good. Give me a shot. You want some? You wanna take a hit? No, 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 no. You take, you take it right in the face. Oh, God. <laughs> that was the back of your throat. Not bad. Hits you right in the back? He aimed right in the back. Right? It hit, it hit the little punch in the back, didn't it? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Look at these. Yeah. Look at these. Golly. Oh, well, they turned into little patties. Little patties. The, the length, it happens. Yeah. It gets cold outside. All right, well, these guys are about done up. We're going to get them the feastings prepared, and we're going to make our guard dogs. Stay tuned. Shee! Look at them golden crispies, Banjo. They look good. <laughs> they, well, they went from hot dog to hamburger. We'll make it. We'll fit it between two bones. It'll be the first time you've had to finesse that. Huh? You've done, he's been there and done that. All right. Take these guys off. Drain them. I mean, dang, boy. Sheesh. That look, that look straight KFC. Yeah. yeah. Wow. I mean, that looks like it's straight. Yeah. Dude, you're nuts for grabbing yeah, that. Made of what the hell? It ain't that hot. So what do you Just cut your bun down. Should you just, yeah. just cut your bun yeah. down? Just rip that bun off. There you just go. The whole half Perfect. Of it. I mean, that looks yeah. pretty good, to be honest. Guard dog sliders. Guard dogs. All right. Is that yours, Banjo? Sure. Yeah, I'll put you. You want to be over there? You want to come over yeah, here? Yeah, I'll come over Where's here. Where's he going? I don't know. You got tar tartar sauce? No, I ain't using that. You're not? No. How, how was the ranch? Was it good? Oh, it's it, all right. It's, it's not very like, ranchy. It's, it's not, not very, very strong. Yeah, it's not very good. Really. It's good. All right, so I'm going to take mine. I'm going to set it here for just now. I'm going to take my tartar sauce and get the sauce down on the bottom. How's that going? Good night. Yikes. Good night. Lather son. it. Sheesh. It's gore. How do you not lather it? Sheesh. Dude, hopefully this is fire. Yeah. I mean, it's pretty easy the way we cleaned it and the way we cooked it. All right. So we're going to go ahead and throw some tartar on it. Bam. All right. Let, let me get some more sauce. There it is. Oh, look out. Shit in the half pickle. Oh, red. Look at that. Perfect. I yeah. mean, come on now. 
Look at that guy. Get some, really. Get some slaw, just laid in there, laid it right in that crevice. How does that make you feel? I mean, it looks pretty, looks pretty good. All right, boys. Look what we got that. That's like a po' boy there, son. Yep. Yeah. Look at that. Is this too hot to eat, you think? No. Dude, he's always just doing it. How's that? <laughs> That's got to be hot. Piece in there. Is it hot or no? He got the thumbs up on guard. It's hot. I'd wait. <laughs> it's hot away. All right. Well, we're going to wait. Well, he goes in for another We'll be back after this commercial break. All right, boys. She's still going to be piping. We're going for it. Wow. That's damn good. All right. Okay. Woo. That is really good. I'm gonna be honest here. <clears throat> one more, one more. Just, just before I give you guys a conclusion here. I think I'd give that to anybody, and they say it's catfish. Yeah. I'm serious. God dang, son. That's good. I mean, I sat there and took another bite going, can you feel out any gaminess? I, I could sell that in Florida as a grouper sandwich. Really? Yeah. I mean, dude, that is, here, I'm gonna, this is what I'm gonna do. The meat does not look good, I'll be honest. I mean, look what you got dang on there. The flavor? Good. I don't know what happened right there. That was tough, yeah. I don't know why that's so t tough right there. I didn't have any of that. That's one of the most tendons. You gotta try that. You gotta tell me if you think that was, that's a catfish. Uh-oh, <laughs> uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh oh, rip. Why'd it do that? Why'd it give you a big dog? That was a big chunk. Big bite. I don't know why it did that. Big boy, big bite. Good lord. We gotta move them jaws. Figure that <laughs> Other one out. Other than the... Toughness. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. That piece wasn't tough at all. I don't. So maybe I filleted it wrong. Cause it's got like it all got tense. Yeah, maybe you got hit. Fine. Maybe you got spank the meat with a mallet or something. Maybe you got tenderize it. No, he can't. What was wrong? You don't think you did that good? You just squirted on Banshee. Did you see that? He did. Oh my that's god. A piece. Oh, this wait. Is why? Wait. Wait. Gross. Wait. Why is it like that? Oh god. Wait. What's going on there? <laughs> wait. Why is it so tough? That would suck. Wait. Why is that tough? Dude, what about this one? You gotta go and just eat that like KFC. All right. Just. I, you gotta get redemption yeah, on that. Tartar. Good lord. No, go with this. Go with this. Here, you got yeah. a half a bun. Yeah, go with this. You this stuff's play. way better. There's, I don't know why it was so tough. Why was it so tough I like that? I have no clue. My piece was fine. There you okay, go. Okay, that looks normal. That looks normal. Is that better? Mm-hmm. I mean... I don't know what you did to that. I don't know what I did. I, I genuinely don't know why it was tough like that. Like, I must have I must have left a tendon. This is just a good way to eat it. What do you think about that? It's hotter than crap. Hotter than hell. Really? But the flavor... It's this good. Fire. Yeah. I mean, I when I took my bite, if you said, what fish is this? I would have first said catfish before I said gar or carp or anything like that. I would have yeah. said tire off your truck. Well, of, minus the toughness. I grouper, so. Banjo's, Banjo's got the best piece, apparently. Yeah. I got to figure out why mine tensed up like that. I am not sure why. But when I got the coleslaw, the tartar sauce, the bun, the full gar dog experience, I mean, that was incredible. The flavors. Inside. I mean that's that's cookbook worthy. I, I opinion. Better than the garbals. Oh, made. by a like mile. Oh is yeah. Because the flavor of the garbals are always like over. Yeah, it's whatever you, whatever you put in it. Yeah, yeah, that's minus the fact that it got real tough. And maybe maybe it's overcooked. Maybe I mean I don't think it was undercooked. It looked really cooked. Yeah. Maybe it, you think it's overcooked? You think that, that piece was skinnier than the other one? Maybe was it? Got too done. I don't maybe, know. Maybe, maybe got overcooked and got a little rubbery. But if you find yourself shooting some guard, do not throw them in the trash. Do some research. Figure out how to skin them, how to clean them. I really don't think it's that hard. It's a little different, but it's not difficult. Difficult. And minus the fact that it shriveled up into a tense freaking muscle, it, this flavor is amazing. I mean, banjo. Two thumbs up. Banjo house this. Yeah. So I think that's cookbook worthy. Gar dogs make it into the cookbook. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video of us shooting fish out in the river. It was a maiden voyage for this season, the beginning of an entire summer of catfishing, gar fishing, uh, trying to bow fish. If you guys like these videos, let us know in the comment section down below. If you guys enjoyed today's video, and peace.